Hi everyone. Today we are going to learn in math the probability with pattern. Okay, so this is the topic 14.1 patterns and probability. You can watch, you can watch my previous uh, video that uh, I explained how do we make uh, patterns, right? So this is the page 213. So guys, first of all, uh, let me revise what are the patterns. So look at the order of the shapes, okay? So look at the first row, we got a circle, okay? After a circle, there is a triangle. Okay, now we have to revise this pattern. After a triangle, again, we have a circle. Okay, so what after a circle, there is a triangle. Again, we have to repeat these shapes. After the triangle, there is a circle. So we call this pattern. Pattern means when we repeat the shapes, okay? So now look at this blue pattern. We got a circle, then two triangles. So what come after a two triangles? A circle. So what comes after a circle? Why we choose first circle? Because there is one circle. So after the circle, what comes a two triangles? So you must add one more triangle, okay, after a circle because we need two triangles. So let's look at this red line. Look at the pattern. So look what things are re repeating. A circle after triangle. Then circle, triangle. Circle, triangle. Circle, triangle. So what comes after the triangle? The circle. So in this way, we can make two, uh, we can make patterns, okay? And what can be the probability after the triangle? The circle. So <clears throat> look at the blue a pattern. A circle to triangle. Circle to triangle. Circle, then to triangle. So in this way, you can make the patterns of the shapes. All right, guys. So here is a look, look at the first uh, question. Here we got uh, four parts, A, B, C, and D. So let's uh, do the part A. So here are the pattern. So first of look, what we have, what colors we have in the pattern. So this is a gray color and here are the two red colors. So what before the two red colors? A gray rectangle. So what after the two red rectangles? A gray rectangle. So what comes after the rectangle, gray, the two tri two rectangles, and then gray rectangles. So what are the next two after the gray rectangle? Yes, the two rectangles. So in this way, you have to complete this uh, question. Uh, look at the blue, yellow. So what comes after yellow? You have to guess because there are three colors we are using, blue, yellow, and gray, okay? Blue, yellow, and gray. So you have to color and complete this. And you have to make uh, your own uh, pattern. You can choose any two color. You can choose two green, one red, then two red, sorry, two green, red, and two green and red. You can make your own pattern. 
So uh, here is uh, question number two, guys. And uh, here we got a circle A and circle B. So you have to color the pattern according to these circles. So the arrow turns on each spinner, okay? Look at the arrow. They are turning on each spinner. On which spinner is the arrow most likely to land on brown? So you have to choose which comes more. Okay, so here is a part uh, three. Guys, so work with a partner, you will need a coin. Here, you will need a coin. You guys can choose the coin for Saudi Arabia, right? Uh, Real, okay. So you can choose uh, this, this side. This side is, we call it head. And this side, we call it a tail, okay? Or you can name tail this one or head this one. Okay, you can name then, okay? So choose uh, this one as the tail and this choose as the head. Okay, so when you uh, throw the coin into the air from your finger, so guess head comes or tails come, okay? So when you throw, maybe it, it's probability head or tail. So when you find out the result, like when the coin fall on the land, you have to check, is it head or is it tail? You can write here, head or tail. So you can check again, second time, and throw the coin into the air. So you have to guess what will appear, the head or tail. If head appear, right here. If tail appear, right here. So in this way, you can complete this uh, head and tail activity. So uh, here is the investigations, okay, about uh, here is the spinner. When you spin this spinner, so you have to check how many times red and how many times blue. So you will need uh, two friends, okay? You need a partner. So player one can be you and player two is your friend. So you have to spin and check how many times red the spinner will stop and how many times blue the spinner will stop. You have to write answers here. You can write numbers here. So here is a today's class. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day.